morning after having several tantrums, like crazy tantrums. So we're on the way to the park and there's a dog. <laughs> and he insisted on wearing his head. It's been quite the morning. I just wanted 10 minutes to put my face together and he was just not having it. Having it. We spent like 20 minutes playing computer games and then put him down and he had such a tantrum like I've never seen him just like ball his fists up and just blah, like just scream. Anyway, he calmed down after a while and I wanted to bring him out anyway because I was up really late getting the vlog together for that you've seen today, which was yesterday. That's right. It's the park. Oh, you see the ball. Oh, cool. You know, there's easier ways to get down. Will you learn that? I keep trying to teach you. No? Okay. Anyway, we're at the park. Splash pad's on. It's supposed to be another really hot day today, so I figure might as well do this now. He can run around. It's not too hot right now, but it's supposed to get really bad again today. So he can run around. If he wants to get wet, he can get wet. And uh oh, fridge fried truck. Get that out of our system. Hey? Let's get this out of our system. Yeah, your hat's pretty cool. I like that you're keeping it on. <laughs> you look so cute. Oh yeah? Okay. We're dog chasing. <laughs> Screw the park. There's a dog to go find. <laughs> We're not gonna go that way, buddy. He's not quite sure how to use this yet. And his feet are just a little too short to get on those pedals. They really need like a strap or something. And that thing there that you can put your feet on is actually too too close for him to comfortably put his feet on. So he's like in in between. Hey diddle diddle, the cat in the fiddle, the cat also jumped over the moon. Mm -hmm. The cat was the star of the show. He fired the dish and the spoon. going on? Tea. Tea? I need to get my purse. And then we get to go see Grandma. <gasps> oh, oh. Ready to see Grandma? Can you say Grandma? Grandma? Looks like you tried to say it. No, Daddy's behind me. We're going to see Grandma. And Uncle Paul. No, Uncle Paul. He said, come on, let's just go. <laughs> Stop talking already. Get your purse. Suspense is killing me. <laughs> let's go. Okay, we're going. We decided to inadvertently meet Donna halfway from work. She's taking a trip. Doop-a-doop-a-doop. 
taking a trip. <laughs> I love watching him walk. It's so cute. Oh, a butterfly. You find a butterfly? No? A butterfly, sugar, baby. Bus. Yeah? I don't see another bus. I heard when the dog walked by, I heard a woof. Oh, did you say woof? See you later. It's date night. We're watching movies. Panoramic vision. Ooh, romantic. Sorry, Ava. <laughs> Our younger viewers just groaned. <laughs> <laughs> We're seeing the man from Uncle. I've been dying to see it because I love that whole 60s spy espionage, international espionage type movie. Yep. And this one just looks fun and campy and it's Guy Richard, Guy Richards, Guy, Guy Richards. Richards. <laughs> Cause I know we got the wrong about. director. <laughs> Guy Richards new movie. <laughs> Guy Richie's new movie. <laughs> my dad and my brother's name is Richard. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Everybody's Richard. Um, we get to see if uh, Superman can actually act. Mm-hmm, not just right? look pretty. Yep. Mm -hmm. um, he still got that, still looks like a very <laughs> handsome man, but he's uh, We'll see if he can be a suave spy instead of just a muscle-bound guy with a cape. But let you know, I really, I have good hopes for this, which could be a good thing or a bad thing. Yeah, let's just go in and see what happens. Yeah. All right. We survived date night. We're still together. So, thumbs up. That's a win in in my books. Because <laughs> you know how we're always fighting. You see that in the vlog. So. uh if we survive date night unscathed, she only slapped me once. It's, all right. it's, a, it's a good thing. I don't know where I'm going with that. Uh, we saw Man from Uncle. I uh, have vague memories of the TV show um, when I was younger. I'm not so young as to have grown up with it, uh, for those wondering. But it was so on. So young, so old. So, right. Mm -hmm. it's, it's late. Peanut gallery over here. <laughs> Um, but yeah, we uh, we'll get you in the shot here. Mm -hmm. I don't need to be in every shot. <laughs> so, um, welcome to the Allen Show. Uh, tickling me down there. <laughs> What's going on? Um, lost my train of thought. Uh, we saw Man from Uncle, the adaptation. The adaptation. I don't know how to explain it's an adaptation. You Stop know it's a movie. Talking. We saw a man from Uncle. And it was good. It was fun. It was a throwback, uh, not just in the the era, but also in the style of the film. It was just a it was it didn't take itself all that seriously and it was fun. Uh lots of cheesy double entendres like the old Bond movies, um, but better action than the old Bond movies, so it was just a, a really good amalgam of all these different things that both Teresa and I like, and it was fun. Solid, solid movie. Uh, anytime I like a movie, I say it's solid. Solid. It's, a, what is it? On fleek? It's what? I'm trying to understand the word fleek. Fleek? Yeah. I don't, I've never it, heard that. Oh, it's like the new way of saying on point, I think, if I understand the young kids oh. correctly. I work with young kids and you know what's going on more than I do. Maybe, maybe this was like two years ago, <laughs> but I've been hearing it a lot lately. So. Well, if you can explain that to us, that'll save me a trip to Urban Dictionary. So write that in the comments below. Um, uh, maybe it's a Ben Affleck reference. <laughs> That's really Affleck. Fleek. Yeah, that's because he has, he has French ancestors. <laughs> so he's Ben Affleck. <laughs> Hello, I am <laughs> the new Batman. <laughs> I will hit you with my bat baguette. <laughs> and then the comment section was stormed by angry French people. <laughs> so I'm being horribly offensive. Um, whatever, everyone likes baguettes. You did good, France. <laughs> Cheese and baguettes, you're good in my books and wine. 
and berries. Berets? And mines. And my uh, see, you lost it at the end, but <laughs> as long as they're giving me a baguette, I will high five a mime. A real but baguette. But like a, like a mime high five. Baguette. Yeah. If it was a fake one, you get a punch in the face. <laughs> Do I have a career in miming? No. <laughs>